Now what we're gonna do is cut up a potato to make french fries. Who doesn't wanna eat french fries? That's my favorite. And what I'm gonna do is just cut them in round, thin slices. Whenever you're cutting, take your knuckles and bend them back, which prevents you from cutting your fingers. And the other thing is, don't talk to the camera while you're cutting, <laughs> although I am. And you can use any potatoes. This happens to be an Idaho potato, which is one of the most common potatoes. You can use Long Island potatoes. You can use sweet potatoes, which are really wonderful when you fry them. And that's all you have to do is cut them up and drop them in oil. I use safflower oil or sunflower oil. I don't use canola oil. People talk about it being very good. But I find that when it cooks, it has a very smoky kind of, it smokes and it has a burnt smell to it. So I do not prefer it. I really like to have safflower or sunflower oil. They're very light oils and they're pure oils and they're very good for you. Okay, we're just gonna take the potatoes and get them ready to go. Now we have our oil for the potatoes. And we're gonna throw our slices in. Put them in individually. Sometimes when you put them in together, they will stick together. So you just wanna make sure they're separated. Them in one by one. Please be careful when you're working with hot oil. Pay attention to it. It does <coughs> tend to splatter, especially when you're putting in food that's wet. These are great, oh nice. And you can cover that as well. Wow, look at this, we've got this fried chicken here. I can't wait to put my teeth into it. With the fried chicken, I have maple syrup and hot sauce. It may sound strange to you, try it, you might like it. And here's some frizzled onions, which use the same seasoned flour and oil that the rest of the food was cooked in. We have our french fries, little round french fries with ketchup, and our fried tilapia with tartar sauce. Please enjoy this. <laughs>